Space Launch System is now counting down to lift off of Orion on its maiden voyage to the moon. Launch team can no longer recycle the count. Sound suppressor water now flowing 15. under the ML. And here we go. Ten. Hydrogen burnoff igniters initiate. Seven, six, five, four stage engine start. Three, two, one. Boosters in the And lift off of Arcus One. We rise together back to the moon and beyond. All four RS-25 engines on the four stage and two solid rocket boosters now propelling the vehicle at 128 miles per hour. for solid rocket booster jettison and shortly thereafter. Confirmation that the solid rocket boosters have separated these 177 foot boosters. Now the core stage continues to power the flight of Orion all four RS-25 engines. We just had confirmation that the service module fairing has separated and that the launch abort system pyros have fired, separating those from Orion as well. We're standing by for core stage main engine cutoff. And we have confirmation of core stage main engine cutoff. And we just heard the call for core stage separation. That means Orion and the interim cryogenic propulsion stage are now flying free from the core stage of the space launch system. The next milestone will be solar array deploy approximately 18 minutes after liftoff. See those four solar arrays unfolding now. And we have confirmation of perigee rays maneuver ignition and full thrust. Again, a really short burn. We're standing by for the cutoff. And we have confirmation of perigee rays maneuver cutoff. And that was the perigee rays maneuver, lifting the lowest part of Orion's orbit around the Earth and putting us right where we want to be for the translunar injection burn. And we have cut off of the interim cryogenic propulsion stage, which has committed Orion to the translunar conjection. The spacecraft is moon bound.